And welcome back to On the Branch. Hey, little buddy. Hey. Little space pirate guy. Shoot him in his face. So there was nothing. Shot. We backtracked a couple rooms and there was nothing that I missed that I could have gotten with super missiles. That we could find anyway. We'll probably yeah. find it later and be like, oh, hey, this is the Yeah, one. on our super long extended fast forward. I think there's some stuff behind more, some of these um, force fields. More awesome Metroid remixes. Well, um, yeah. Is there a... I, there's got to be a good Metroid Prime remix that I already know I have. I'm, I'm sure we can find. Oh, oh I that love was weird. Yeah, the, the glare when that, her that you can see the, uh, her eyes. Yeah. Weird. Oh, you hadn't noticed that? That's like the third time I've seen that this game. I mean, it just doesn't happen that often. No, they they like to keep that effect from really being everywhere and getting annoying. Yeah. Um, I mean, it's just cool every once in a while thing, and if, if you notice it. Yeah, I think one of these force fields has a power up behind it. Well, one I of them mean, has a Metroid behind it. Oh wait, yeah, all these, all those force fields are gonna get lowered at some point anyway. So, uh, on the very real soon. Yeah, very real soon. So, I finally went through. Oh, my... red thing! Yay! That probably unlocks everything. Oh yeah, you have three There's of those. There's your to visor. Scan. Yeah, that's my visor upgrade that I was thinking I was getting. So, I was going through all my stuff at my house. Yeah. Um, like where all my game systems were. Uh huh. I found some really awesome stuff. Yeah, you found a Super Nintendo controller that's not all janked up like mine is. Yeah, it's in like very pristine condition, which is really freaking awesome. Yeah. Considering yeah. it is an original any, uh, Super Nintendo controller and not some jank ass third party thing. Yeah, and I, I have never found a third party SNES controller that is worth anything. Um,. um like, comment, subscribe if you know a third-party SNES yeah. controller. Yeah, link us. Like, Please. link it in the comment section if you have found... And then upvote it if you find a, if someone says a good one that you know. Yeah, because uh, we haven't found anything. We've bought several, and they're all garbage. Um, we're we're going to start using my good one. Now. I had a good one when I was a kid, and I still have it. It's, it's getting a little worn out, but yeah. there's no way they still manufacture it. But, um, yeah, so I was going through all my stuff. Uh-huh. Um, and I finally found my Dreamcast. Yay. Oh, no. You know what that, no. you know what that means, John? No. Yeah. No. You get to play Sonic Adventure 2 with me. No. Yeah. On the Dreamcast. No. That system that you really hate the controller for, for absolutely no reason. I don't... I have a very good reason for hating that controller. And why and is that? It's made for people whose elbows are forced inward and always touching each other, because otherwise that that controller just absolutely demolishes your wrists after half an hour of play. No, because you just hold it like this. That's good uh, radio right there. Yeah. I, I hold it everyone, like this. Everyone, everyone to just imagine... Every, everyone look I at Amerith's a... hands. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll give Chris a picture of my hands. Oh, that's so much work. Hey! We're oh, fighting. Great. Let's just play the rest of the game like this. This will be awesome. <laughs> yeah. Just, the... just in infrared. No one will hate that. Nope. All right. Oh, hey, and the power ups are more visible. Yay. Yeah. Um. So yeah, and I found like my three good games that weren't my brother's stupid sports games because you know everyone just loves playing sport ball ninety ninety nine. You or... know, I am a fan of some sports. I have never been a fan of a sports game. Not even NBA Jam. I know. Hate me. <sighs> hate me. I mean, I can understand because NBA Jam was one of those weird games. It was like. It could have been good, and it was well, kind a, of a okay. lot of people loved it. It's 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 a very it's a very unique game, and that's about all I have to say about it. Yeah, I just I don't I think I like some golf games because they're nothing like actual golfing. Um, yeah, I'm trying. I'm struggling for a single sport. Oh, tennis games like Mario Tennis. Mm. Uh, Mario Tennis for the sixty four was incredible. Um, but yeah, yeah, I think that's it. I I found uh four of my more favorite and more interesting um Sega uh, Dreamcast games that may eventually get played on this channel. So aside from Sonic Adventure two, um, I still have to find my Sonic Adventure one, but um, Sonic we're, Shuffle. We're not no. We're, so why don't we just play Mario Party? No, because I want to play Sonic Mario Party. Oh, okay, because all the other Let's Players play uh, Mario Party, so, yeah, we'll, so play... we'll be the Rebels and play Sonic Shuffle. Why can't is... we just play Dokapone Kingdom? Uh, we could always... 
Yeah. Wait, is that the game that ends friendships? Uh, it is a game that ends friendships. Yes. Because I was gonna say, I, th- I, that name sounds familiar. Yeah, it uh, it ends friendships. Absolutely. Uh, we we may end. end Jamie has friends. friends she doesn't hang out with anymore because of that because game. Because of that game. Yeah. Oh boy. Yeah. That's uh wonderful. So yeah, um, Sonic Adventure Two, Sonic Shuffle, Tony Hawk Pro Skater Two. Ooh. The the best. Tony Hawk game because skateboarding game. Oh, but, hey, it's a sentry thing. Ah, uh, it's screwing with your visor. I can't yeah. see anything. And now it's got a bright light. Walk into the light, Samus. Okay, don't uh, walk into the light. Please don't. Shoot the thing. Oh, this is really cool when it blows up. Oh, no. Wait. Wait. Normally when they blow Bail. up, they like turn your entire Bail. screen static. Bail. So we did have to backtrack. I lied. Yep. We had to backtrack anyway. There he is. Um, Do we have regular light yet? I don't want to check while I'm fighting. I don't think so. Um, no. Nope. Still darkness. Um, the other game that I found was um, How the Grinch Stole Christmas. What? It, but it's not a regular... The game? But it's not just a regular How the Grinch Stole Christmas game. It's a How the Grinch Stole Christmas the movie. So it's right. with Jim Carrey. Of course it is. I mean, why not? Um, yeah. Does it tell you not to vaccinate your children? Uh, no. <laughs> um, so it's not a real Jim Carrey game. Uh, maybe it's the, that the one. only thing that I remember about this game, aside from it being extremely terrible and extremely poor gameplay Oops. Oops. for a game that was very much like regular Banjo Kazooie games. Um, was the fact that throughout the game you collect, like, blueprints and stuff to make, like, the Grinch's devices, and at one point you make his submarine. He has a submarine? James oh, in this game. same thing. Yeah. Um. And we're gonna play this game, right? Yeah, because it's gonna be fucking terrible. Yeah. Um, and the only thing I remember him this saying... This was for the Dreamcast? This was for the Dreamcast. And people say it was piracy that killed the Dreamcast. <laughs> Um, all I remember was when... It turns out, ladies and gentlemen, 15 years later, we have found out what truly killed the Dreamcast. It was Jim Carrey, all along. (laughs) Um, when when you make the submarine... First he killed comedy. Shut up a second. Then he killed the Dreamcast. Shut up a second. When, When he said, when you make the submarine, he says, and I quote, Aha, my marine mobile. And, and... And now he's killing hundreds of children a year with his anti-vaccination campaign. Yep. Um, vaccinate your kids. Like, That's comment, subscribe health. if you vaccinate your kids. And um, stop watching this if you don't, please. And and kill yourself. But, but I like all the subs, even if they don't vaccinate their kids. Um, okay, but, fine. But, but, but we're, still, we're, we're still going to, like, We're going to look at you sternly yeah, until... Yeah, we're, we're giving you a very stern look and saying, vaccinate your children. I don't want your little... Your little disease uh, vectors to, infecting to cause me. the three percent that will actually get the vaccinated kids sick. Yeah, because yeah. that's how vaccinations work. And because... especially, don't go to Disneyland. Yeah, please don't. Yeah, that there you cannot vaccinate your kids. Just never let them outside of your house because I mean, let's face it: if you don't vaccinate your children, well, if, if they you vac- probably live in a bubble if, anyway. I was gonna say, yeah, you may as well just put them in a bubble, like that one really bad movie. Yeah, well, I was gonna say that generally, if you're not vaccinating your kids, you probably already don't let your child outside, but like twice a year. So, yeah, you know, maybe it's maybe it's not the problem we thought because it's not safe out there for free thinking. Um. Oh yeah. Ooh. So I I remember so pretty. I remember what happened with my Dreamcast too. So this was a very long time ago, back when I was nope, half nope, my age. Nope, nope, just going to run straight through. Yep. When I was half my age. Oh, my wait. Dr- there's something here yep. that I can get with a super missile. Yep. Um, you can break that one window. Yeah. Um, I My Dreamcast broke. Uh-huh. Um, the lens actually stopped reading discs. Okay. That's um, a very specific problem for a Dreamcast to have. Well, being like... 12 or 13 or whatever it was at the time, I didn't fucking know how to fix it. Right. Um, how did you even figure out that was the problem? Um, I actually brought it into 
a basically it was a mom and pop game shop. That Wait, I was it Game Repair? Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a local. That place has been around for like thirty years. Mm, yeah. Hey, uh, yeah. If you're ever in Vegas, check out this company called Game Repair. It's nothing special. It's nothing to write home about. But they fix game systems, and uh, they're really sweet people. Yeah. And they, it's, they fix my Dreamcast. Yeah, it's this family run business that's been in town for like. Years. At least 25 years, because we used to buy games there frequently. We'd buy them used when I was a I kid. I want to go back in there and just see what the fuck they have. That's where I bought my Game Boy. Well, there are, I think there are like three or four locations around town now. Is yours on, on Nellis and Stewart? No. Okay, yeah, they, they've... they It's not like mom and pop, I would say. I mean, it's sort of mom and pop. I mean, but... it, it's as close to mom and pop as you're going to get in big city. Yeah, well, I mean, it is owned by a specific family, so it is mom and pop in that sense. Yeah, it's yeah. not it's not GameStop. It hasn't been eaten by GameStop yet. Yeah, they're like one of the few. Maybe this is the thing I super but missile. Yeah, Do I super they, missile that window? I think so. They um Nope, I have to plasma they, that. They window. fixed it for twenty bucks. Twenty bucks, really? Yeah. Shit. Go down to GameStop now. Tell them uh, on the branch sent you. They'll be very confused GameStop? because no one's heard of us. No, no, go down, oh, sorry, Game Repair. Yeah. Go down to Game Repair. Yeah, go to GameStop, tell them on the branch sent you. Uh, and tell them to close their entire chain, and to just become part of Game Repair, because they should just sell out. Yeah, sell out, I don't think that's how it works. Yeah, that's exactly how it works. I thought there was something here that I could get with nope, Super Missiles. Nope, you're wasting everyone's time. Well, okay, then, then my life is complete. Wait, what about that? Um... Nothing. Is just there something a... that you can break on that tower up there? No, well, you have to, like, shoot something from out the window, I believe. Yeah, you can only do it from in there, out that window that you have to melt because it's ice. And, you mm. know, missiles can't break ice. You know, that's... Video game logic. That'd be too much effort. Yeah. So, well, okay, we have to come back here once we have that thing. Yeah. And we'll stop wasting time next time on the branch. Uh, do we have to stop wasting time? Mm, eh, we can waste some time. Okay, bye. We'll waste some time next time on we, the branch. We will waste some time. <laughs>